Good day, Sacramento. I'm Lori Wallace hanging out in Elk Grove this morning at Pino's Palette. Now, I was here the day that they shut down. So this is pretty wild to be back and seeing what they've done since I was last here. This was a 21 and over spot when they first opened. And then they expanded to add families, kids, all ages. Then COVID hit, all that was put on pause. And now Stacy, you are back open completely, not just with the painting, but you have a whole new bar and restaurant and all kinds of fun things going on. We do. So we have expanded the bar twice now and uh, we've got food in here, all kinds of flatbread pizzas and things. So the food is great. And we have definitely expanded the studio. Um, our influx of people that need a good night out um, has really increased. So um, we're trying to make space for everybody and um, make sure we've got plenty of things to do for everyone. Yeah, so this area that we're standing in, this is the original space so people would be most familiar with. This was the whole studio. Sure. And now you've added on additional rooms. How many extra spaces do you have now? So we have two additional rooms. So we have two large studios that can hold 42 people each. And then we have another private studio that can hold uh, small groups up to 20 people. Okay, I'm going to let uh, Stacy show the way. As we go down the hallway, you'll notice these big chunky blankets because not only do you do the painting, but you do some fun other classes too. We do, we do. We do all kinds of fun things. We uh, paint wine bottles, we paint wine glasses, we do chunky knit blankets, we do acrylic pours, all kinds of different things. Paint on wood, we paint on everything. Okay, so this is one of the new rooms. So this is the new room, the second new room. This is our large one. This can be a large private room or we use this as public classes too for overflow. Um, or now we're starting to add additional classes on Friday and Saturday nights. So there's more options to paint from and more space for people to come in. And what's really cool when you walk through here, there's so much art. You actually feel like you're walking through a museum looking yeah. at everything. Yeah, there are a lot of paintings on the walls. I wasn't sure I was gonna have enough to fill them up. <laughs> so- But was, you did. I did, I did. My husband was a little questioning. He's like, I don't think I'm here gonna make it. Like, I am, I am. Yeah, and you can tell as you look at all the different pieces, all the different theme nights that you have. And that's what makes this kind of a really special experience. People can come in with family, friends, or their kids, and absolutely. everybody does the same thing. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. We do all kinds of fun, uh, different kinds. Um, we do family uh, paintings on Saturday mornings, every Saturday morning, so kids' classes or family classes. And then, um, you know, all of our classes are all ages now. So if you have a five-year-old that can do a two-hour class, and we have had that happen, and they did fantastic. Uh, so, you know, everyone can join all of our classes. Okay, so this room right here is really cool. They call it the Abyss. It's the black light room, and because it's in the back here and there's no windows, this is actually a black light painting room all day long. So not just at night, but people can come in uh, and do private parties in here too. Correct. We can do um, tw private parties up to 20 people and we can do black light paintings in here. We can also do regular non black light paintings, uh, but this just makes it really unique. It's something that nobody else offers and it just uh, it just makes it really, really fun. So, um, yeah, we've used this quite a few times now. Okay, you can find all their information at Pino's Palette on Facebook, on Instagram. We'll link everything to our website, too. But before we go, one of my most favorite paintings I've seen this morning, Cody, uh -huh. it's your spirit animal. Oh, look at that. <laughs> that is your spirit animal. I looked at that and I thought, that reminds me of Cody in the weirdest way. Yeah. It's got the same teeth and everything. So I said, Let, let's just go in spirit. <laughs> I kind of want it. Like, I, I, I almost want to ask so if I can great. have it. <laughs>